Welcome to our series Can It Be Hacked? Today we're soaring to new heights with one of the most thrilling hacking scenarios depicted in Hollywood. Can an airplane really be hacked mid-flight? From the movie, Nonstop, to an episode of, Mr. Robot, we've seen it dramatized but how grounded in reality is it? As always this content is for educational purposes only. Fasten your seatbelts let's dive in. To start off let's understand how a modern airplane works. They are essentially flying computers with systems and subsystems communicating with each other to keep the aircraft flying safely. In order to control an airplane mid-flight, a hacker would need to compromise the airplane's avionic systems. These are the critical systems that enable flight and are made up of several different subsystems. Let's explore some of these subsystems that a hacker would theoretically need to breach. First up is the Flight Management System or FMS. This is essentially the brain of the airplane, helping the pilot to navigate and control the plane. It feeds information to other systems and also receives inputs from them. An intrusion here could potentially mislead the pilots or alter the plane's course. Next are the flight control systems, which manage the plane's moving parts like ailerons, elevators, rudders, and flaps. Hacking into this could allow a person to interfere with the airplane's movement, but as you can guess, these are heavily protected and isolated from non-critical systems. Another critical system is the communication system, which helps the airplane stay in touch with ground control. A hacker targeting this system could, in theory, disrupt the communication between the pilots and air traffic control or even feed false information. And then we have the engine control system, a critical system that manages the engines. Interfering with this system could potentially lead to catastrophic results. Again, it's worth emphasizing just how secure and isolated these systems are. Finally, there's the aircraft's data network, which is like the central highway for data exchange between the airplane systems. Access to this could theoretically provide a hacker with a pathway to multiple subsystems. In addition to these, there are many more smaller systems that work in tandem for an airplane to operate smoothly. Each has its own layers of security, including physical isolation, data encryption, robust firewalls, and real-time intrusion detection. So the question is could a hacker gain access to these systems, potentially causing a mid-air catastrophe? In theory, it could be possible. However, the chances of it happening are extremely low. Firstly, an airplane's critical systems like flight controls and navigation are segregated from passenger systems such as in-flight entertainment and Wi-Fi. This segregation acts as a barrier, making it difficult for a potential hacker to cross from a passenger system to a critical system. Furthermore, these systems are protected by multiple layers of security, which include firewalls, intrusion detection systems, regular software updates, and more. Assuming that a hacker could get through these defenses, they would also need to have a deep understanding of avionics, the complex systems that aircraft use for flight and navigation. This is not common knowledge even among skilled hackers. And as we've emphasized in our previous videos, hacking into any system without authorization, let alone in airplanes, is illegal and highly unethical. The penalties for such a crime are severe, including hefty fines and lengthy prison sentences. While it might make for an edge-of-your-seat movie plot, the reality is that hacking an airplane mid-flight is highly unlikely. In our next episode, we're going to discuss if it's possible to hack a satellite to bring it crashing down. That's one you won't want to miss. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep learning, stay curious, and use your cybersecurity knowledge responsibly. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next one.